What's up guys, Fuji Center here and welcome back to another Minecraft video. And today, the netherite golem is entering the arena again and he's gonna fight all of the immune creatures. So for opponents we have the spire pig, the immune snow golem, the immune creeper, the immune skeleton, the immune enderman, the immune blaze, the immune wither skeleton, the immune shulker and finally the immune zombie. So yeah. So let me just start the battle. If you haven't seen the netherite golem before, he looks like this, and yeah, he's strong, he's a lot stronger than the damn golem, so... I'm not sure that the immune creatures might be able to take down this guy, but uh, let's uh, let's test it. So the first one is gonna be the spire pig versus this guy, and... One versus one is really unfair to this creature, because he only has 40 hit points, so... I will do four. I'm gonna give him some chance, maybe he can do like 50 hit points of damage to this monster. Okay, fight. Okay, um, that guy doesn't want to fight. Okay, I'm just gonna leave you. Okay, so uh, not bad, they did like 35 hit points of damage, so uh, let's just make this guy fight as well. Okay, he's charging like a warrior and got destroyed. Okay, so 4 hit points of damage to the netherite golem. Of course, the first battle had to be a victory for this guy. And now let's bring in the immune snow golem and see if uh, he can do more damage. Alright, I'm gonna spawn like... Yeah, 4 is good. 4 immune snow golems against this guy. Okay, he's added, added as well, and what did I do? Okay, let's just uh, spawn this guy. And uh, here we go. Okay, now they're fighting. He's going after, oh my god. That was intense. Three hits and the guy was dead. Oh my god, this guy is strong. Okay, now he's charging after this guy. He's dead. And yeah, they did more damage than the Spire Pigs. Okay, so um, it was kind of like 58 hit points of damage. Okay, okay, okay. So far, you're doing pretty good. You're doing pretty good. And now let's bring in the Mutant Creeper and uh, see if you can defeat that guy. Because... He is a lot stronger than uh, the immune snow golem. Let's see. Alright, to give them a chance, I'm gonna spawn two immune creepers because um, that guy is like really powerful. We need to give these guys like a chance to fight against him. Okay, they're charging at the immune, uh, the netherite golem. And oh my god, this guy's already dead. Maybe the finishing move might do some damage. It did nothing. I guess the netherite golem is blast resistant to the finishing moves. Okay, okay, so good job netherite golem. You managed to survive the immune creepers and now let's bring in the next contender who is the immune skeleton and let's see if they can do more damage than the immune creepers did. Okay, so two immune skeletons should be enough, I think. Maybe to do like 68 points of damage or more. Okay, when well, both of them are attacking him. Oh yeah, they're doing like a lot of damage to the netherite golem. He's like unsure. He, he like first attacked this guy and now he's going after this one. Okay, so far they're doing a lot of damage to the netherite golem. So far they're doing pretty good. Netherite golem is at 110 hit point. Oh my god, wait. If the immune skeleton manages to defeat him, then I'm gonna be impressed, but no. He's at 2 hit points. And is he... Okay. Oh my god, he's at 28 hit points. That was pretty close, and... I think if I had spawned like one more immune skeleton then this guy would have died. 
Okay. Now let's bring in the mute Enderman and see if this guy can defeat them. Okay, this time it's gonna be two mute Endermans against uh, the Netherite Golem. Let's see who's gonna win. And, uh, okay, they should be fighting. Where's the other guy? Okay, he's here. The other guy did some damage and left. And this Enderman, oh my god, he's taking a lot of damage. Okay, he's gonna die. And the Netherite Golem is sucked in in their finishing moves. And these guys did worse than the, the Mune Skeletons, so... Okay. And, oh my god, they did even worse than the Mune Creepers. I, I think the Mune Creepers took him down to like 168 points, if my memory is correct. Which is terrible. Okay, so good job Netherite Golem, so far you're doing pretty good and now let's bring in the stronger ones who is uh, the Mune Blaze and see if you can defeat him. Since the Mune Blaze has like 300 hit points, I'm gonna just spawn one. Maybe he might have a chance against the... Another right golem, okay, another right golem is charging at him, and he already started doing damage. Oh my god, he's going down. Okay, this guy is like trying to go away, like keep his range from him. And another right golem is going after the rodlings. Okay, okay, now he's charging back and the uh, blaze is trying to get away from him. Oh my god. Okay, he, he managed to like, get away from him. He escaped. Oh, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Both of them are at 60 hit points. Oh, oh, oh my god. What was that move? He went from like 60 hit points to 6 hit points. Okay, the Mune Blaze. I underestimated you, bro. I really underestimated you. Good job. And now let's bring in the next mob who is uh, the Mune Wither Skeleton and see if he can defeat the Netherite um, Golem. Alright, this time it's gonna be two Wither Skeletons, Mune Wither Skeletons against uh, the Netherite Golem. And let me just add these guys first and uh, yeah make both of them fight against uh, the netherite golem okay both of them are fighting him and the one already took like oh my god he's going down he's he's dead and the netherite golem is at 125 hit points and 31 hit points 43 okay I think he has lifesteal ability and he regenerated a lot of health with those hits, but the netherite golem, he managed to defeat both of them. Okay, so far good job netherite golem, you are doing pretty good. And now let's bring in the final mob who is the immune zombie. I'm not sure if he can defeat you, but let's see what happens. Okay, I don't think one sh is gonna be enough, so let's spawn two. And Hopefully they can defeat the netherite golem. Okay. Oh, both of them are enraged. I didn't even have to do anything. And they threw him in the air. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. The netherite golem is taking some damage, but this guy is like halfway, halfway down. Okay, as a team, the Moon Zombie, yeah, they're doing pretty good. Okay, this guy's, he did kept his distance for like 5 seconds, but then he did something stupid and the Netherite Golem, he got inside his range. Okay, he's at, oh, oh my god, he was fighting at 0 hit points. 
Okay, so two immune zombies were enough to kill that guy. Okay, so that concludes the battle, and uh, thanks for watching this video, guys, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye.